Hello, I'm making the tutorial about uh, opening the door when uh, kill these three guys. I used the third person template with uh, some uh, asset from marketplace. First, we need to uh, create uh, the uh, NPCs. So uh, I get before uh, this is a duplicated uh, third person character. Uh, and inside, and inside we need to uh, create a custom event. We need uh, variables pool. You can name it however you want. And after we are calling this event, the uh, that is. Uh, true and default is fast uncheck so and we need some other than some animation here so to confirm that that uh, that's I have s I target uh, this animation f to the basic and epic game, so I can use that. Is mm, okay, okay, and uh, in third person character, we need other the collision box like this. You can uh, press. Uh, first you must click on the capsule and uh, uh, add the collision box you can change the size Pile. so um, we need uh, other the Event, uh, event begin overlap. So when we are overlapping the NPC characters, we we check is is uh, is that and use branch. If is not that, so we set uh, we call the uh, this event custom event in uh, NPC. So let's try it. Okay, and we uh, call it as events once because uh, if it's dead, so we can call it again. I add some, uh, I am add more NPCs, and this gate is blueprint. Uh, inside uh, this gate is uh, this is uh, event from opening the gate, but we need uh, 
some uh, some type uh, counting the uh, how many enemies alive and uh, if is all dead so we uh, we open the gate so uh, after begin uh, event begin play uh, we count uh, we counting uh, how many uh, eyes have and pieces of how many is uh, in the area and is equal Equal when we need custom event t uh, dots open gate. We need uh, open gate, and we need again um, uh, add the card uh, uh, get all actor from class. Is uh, this class is NPCs. And we need loop. And we need uh, a variable. Variable is reference to the NPCs. Is the object type. And we need create the array pile. So at and this okay. We need uh, add to the array, and uh, start in a, we must clear array if the event is called. Because we need next length and uh, length. But we need uh, uh, add the array w uh, only when the enemy is uh, dead. Uh, enemy is dead. So get that. When is the true? Uh, we uh, we add this. And next, we call the branch. So, um, so uh, we have uh, we have in level three NPCs. So, length of uh, all this NPC is three, and. Um, uh, when we call it the open gate, we first uh, clear the uh, array, uh, count how uh, count the NPCs, uh, other the only when the uh, NPC is dead, and is when is the NPC is dead, other the two array. Uh, next, we are calculate uh, when is uh, three. Three uh, NPCs uh, is uh, same as uh, three NPCs with that. So 
if it's true, we call custom event, what we can create custom event or we are move here but we need a sequence and next sequence Uh, we can delete our our enemies, so we can again uh, copy this, get act all actor from class loop, and uh, okay, uh, and there is a uh, one thing. Uh, when we uh, complete the loop we call the branch so because when they this can't three times and there is a one time so uh, after the loop is ending so it's a better and next uh, destroy actor so we destroy a actor in uh, with NPCs Okay, a little clear uh, this uh, uh, this blueprint and set up more readable. So when we be begin play, we count how many enemies uh, NPCs in uh, the area, and uh, when we call it the open gate, we call. We call NPCs how many have NPCs and how many is dead. If is dead, we add the two array. And uh, when it's complete, uh, uh, this array is uh, counted with length. When it's the same as uh, this, we continue to there. There is an event to open the gate. You, you will see. And uh, we are destroying the all actors because we don't need this again okay what we don't uh, end uh, we don't end yet we need a couple changes next oh oh uh, and there is a green light so uh, there is uh, just one event uh, we need to uh, call event uh, on this and uh, how can they do that there is uh, again blueprint communications so open the gate uh, and we need um, Yes. So we need Kate. Um, okay. Gate light. We need a reference to the gate light. So and gate. Ref. Uh, we make the editable because we can call it from there when we click on the gate blueprint we can see get light editable and we are at so return to the gate Uh, after we are opening the gate, we need the uh, next uh, sequence, and 
we call it uh, custom event in uh, this compile and I think there is an owl against the gates. So in NPCs, um, we need event begin play. Uh, we need uh, call this gate. So uh, he is couple way. Uh, I use now get. All actor from class and his actor is gate is only one of act uh, actor so we need uh, get it copy um, compile and promote to the variable because we have only one gate, so uh, get null. If you have multiple gate, uh, I uh, don't recommend these methods because so gate ref. Okay. Uh, after we have gate, we call uh, in a you know in gate. We need call this event open gate. Because we have reference on this. And I think we can do once only. Uh, when you press uh, O and uh, uh, click you can or when I write uh, do once you can compile and we are good to go so after we play finger cross okay you die you die you die okay <coughs> And voila!